Hey, this is Sinqua Walls, and this is the list of the five or six things that I do to stay fit and healthy. Number one, I eat healthy. So it's really important for me that I eat food that I think is recharging to my body, but also I can use as fuel and keeps me lean and also keeps me in shape. I learned along the way that diet is everything. It's not about how much you work out so much. It's not about what kind of workouts you do. It's the balance of fitness, wellness, and most important health. So I've really gotten into um, eating healthy. I've really gotten into becoming a vegetarian. I've been a vegetarian now for a year. And so I only bring in protein that is good for my body. I don't eat meat and I minimize my carbs. And the reason why I became a vegetarian is because I thought to myself, if cows are eating the grass to get strong, then why don't I cut out the cow and eat the grass? Logic. That's all I got. Number two, uh, the number two thing that I do to stay fit and healthy, I get sleep. Um, I used to be a person that was really focused on the more you could stay awake, the more you could get done. And I would sleep maybe two to three hours a night. And then I realized I would wake up every morning tired. I'd drink a lot of coffee. I'd take naps throughout the day, but I wasn't actually being as effective as I could be because I wasn't getting the, the body nutrients, I guess, that I would need by getting enough sleep. So now I focus on getting at least seven to eight hours, no matter where I am, no matter what time it is, no matter if I fly in to another city, no matter whether I'm flying out of another city, I will always try to get those seven to eight hours because I think that is the best way to be the most effective, to keep my brain wired, keep my muscles intact, um, and to keep my body moving as fluidly as I need it to do. So number two, get sleep. That's what I do. Uh, number three, which is very paramount, but again, not the most important. The number three thing I do is stay fit and healthy. I work out. I lift weights. I do interval training. Um, I like to do sprints. I like to run. I was never a runner growing up. And then as I started to eat healthy and lose more weight, I was able to loosen up weight on my joints. I always run on the beach. That's one of my most meditative and enjoyable things to do is to drive to the beach and run for four miles. I get the meditation of the water. I get the exertion of the physical fitness. So that's probably the third most important thing I do to stay fit and healthy is work out. And in that, number one, I always run at the beach because it's meditative and it's reformative. Just pulling out the big words. Um, number four, the number four thing that I do to stay fit and healthy, I drink wine. You know, doctor said an apple a day keeps the germs away, but I say a glass a day keeps everything okay. So if I want to put hard work in and I want to make sure that I'm focused every day, I got to reward myself. So I reward myself with a glass of wine. Many people pour that much. I pour that much because I'm a growing boy. So I got to make sure that I have enough to make sure that I earn the right to work out again the next day. So number four, to stay fit and healthy, I drink wine, red wine, Cabernet, Pinot Noir, Merlot, whatever it is, I will drink. That's number four. Uh, number five, thing that I do to stay fit and healthy, I do yoga. Um, I had a friend once who I told I was going to go do yoga. And I remember him laughing at me because he was like, he didn't want to do it because he thought yoga was just for girls. And I said, that's funny. I wish it was because every time I go to the class, it's nothing but guys. Go figure. After that, he came to the class all the time. Yoga is for everybody. Um, but number five thing that I do to stay fit and healthy is yoga. Again, if you're going to push your body, if you're going to push your joints, you have to give yourself an opportunity to rest and relax. It's also meditative. It's reformative. It's peaceful. I find a little corner, whether I'm going to a class or whether I'm at the beach or whether I'm at the park, find a little section, put on some good music, do some deep stretching. It brings the body back every time. So if I work hard six days a week, I rest on the seventh, and that's typically a yoga day. Wine and yoga. Uh, the number seven thing, is this seven or is this six? Oh, man, the number six thing that I do to stay fit and healthy is don't hang out with toxic people. All those other things are so important to me, but the most important thing is that I'm around people that I love and people that lift me up and people that I can lift up as well. You are the mean of the people around you and you become a representation of your community. So I make sure 
or I try to surround myself with good people that I think have my best interests and I also have theirs. I learned that along the way. Don't hang out with toxic people. Um, and that's what made Resort to Love such an amazing experience because everybody genuinely from the cast, from the crew, to the people that were working at our hotel were amazingly good people. The island of Mauritius was a collection of amazingly good people. So it was a wealth of community. Um, not only did we have fun and we hope the audience has fun, but it was an amazing experience internally and externally. Not hanging out with toxic people is my last, but also my most important tip to stay fit and healthy. And then also watch Resort to Love every week for the next two years.